Welcome back to my channel, Zara's World. So today I thought, why don't I do a chit chat, get rid of me kind of tutorial look. Today I'm just going out with my friends to a restaurant for one of her birthdays. So kind of the glam, night out kind of look. So um, so I'm back after a hectic past month. Like, <sighs> let me just tell you guys, I have been stressed. Like my exam around the corner, there's no problems have popped up. But anyway, I'm back and I'm better and I'm here for you guys to see the look that I made for you guys. So yeah, if you guys want to see how I got this look, carry on watching the video. Make sure you subscribe and like and leave a comment below. Okay, so before I start off anything, can I just emphasize that I am not a makeup artist. I do makeup for the fun of it. I enjoy the looks I come out with and. With me, I really just look at the outfit I'm wearing and then I like mix up the colours so I don't really have a, what do you call it? I don't really like, you know how people beforehand like, okay, I'm going to have this colour eyeshadow, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that. That's not for me. I'm more of a go the flow kind of girl. First off, clip the hair. And if you know me, you know that my hair is um, actually like wavy curly. So I straighten my hair beforehand because... <laughs> gets too crazy sometimes. Right. So I always start off with the NYX HD Definition Eyeshadow Base Primer. So it just basically primes your eyes and makes your eyes ready for any like eyeshadow you put on and it's actually the best like you know what guys I have been breaking out so much recently it is like my exams are like a few weeks away, not only a few weeks, like three weeks away. So this is a time where my hair falls out like crazy, my like spots all start coming, I put on so much weight, I eat so much junk when I'm stressed out, like this isn't a good month and I haven't been well, like I have I just got better, just about. So I was like it's been a good two weeks since I last uploaded a video, three weeks now, three weeks, so I need to upload a new video. So here I am doing a makeup tutorial for you guys. Alright, so, the main thing that I'm going to use for this whole, like, eyeshadow look is probably going to be, is going to be, not probably, I'm going to use a Naked Urban Decay Heat Pack. Look how beautiful the colours are. I mean, wow. So, I'm just going to set my base with, with Sourced. It's this colour right over here. I'm just going to set my base with that. You know what, people always ask me like how can you talk on camera, like to the camera and you post it online, I actually can't, like you guys don't see this yet, but even me saying this, I probably, re I probably said like two, three different times, because I hate the voice, I hate the sound of my own voice, so when I'm editing, I, I, I have to like put the sound to a minimum. And then I edit because I don't like my voice at all. Alright, so once you set a base. Oh. You guys, this glitter. This is Fenty Beauty. I did not wash my brushes beforehand. So, guys, make sure you wash your brushes. You know what? In the comments below, yeah. 
I will pay someone £20 just to wash all my brushes for me because it's such a hassle to wash brushes. Oh, the glitter is everywhere in my eye. You know what? These three colours are like calling out to me. What's this colour called? En Fuego, Ashes, and Ember. Like, those three colours here. But actually, calling out my name. So, let's, let's use those colours today. I'm gonna just tap it in there and put on the end of my eyes. Just dabbing it. And then you're gonna put it in. Do you know what, guys? If you're a makeup artist and you're watching this, please don't judge me. Because. I just do what I think works for my eyes, if that makes sense. But I prefer eye makeup than face makeup. I hate doing face makeup. You can ask anyone, that's everything I complain about all the time. I can't do face. And I can't. I can do eyeliner. Eyeliner is my bait. Oh my god, guys. I can do eyeliner in like a minute. I'll do a video here of how far. I'll time it how fast I can do eyeliner. I can do it in a minute. But anyway. You guys don't understand. I put an alarm on today to wake up early to have a shower and get ready for this video because um I don't have time. I actually don't have time to do anything. I have four assignments to do, I have an exam, it's just all stress on stress, my exam's three hours, have a work notes for it. No. Like yeah, my lectures are all looking long. It's just so much effort, but it's worth it. But it's it's like why well, I keep saying that it's worth it in the end. It's worth it in the end. But is it is it really worth it at the end, Zara? Yeah, it will be once I get those peas. But still, and now we're gonna go in with Kane, Kane, Kane. How do you say K-N? K-N. 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 C-A-Y-E-N-N-E. K-N. K-N. Guys. <laughs> English is, my English is very bad. Like, it's not bad. It's actually not bad. But me pronouncing some things is a struggle for me because, um, I just can't pronounce it. And also, I have braces. If you guys couldn't tell the train tags in my teeth, they're braces. But, um, not grills or anything, or a new fashion accessory, they braces. But also, I have an underbite as well, like, if you guys can see, this bit comes out more. It's an underbite. So hopefully I should begin my operation end of this year. I pray I get it, because I'm so tired of this underbite, like, you gotta realise, I, I never ever take side profile pictures, ever. I, I hate my side profile. I hate anything to do with my side profile. No, it's not for me. So I'm gonna go in Ember. So I'm just gonna. Yo, let me swatch it for you guys and show you guys how amazing it is, alright? So you guys see. Have you guys heard about that contact lens brand? TTDI, something like that. But I. They wrote right, brown skin girls tend to choose dark blue, honey, hazel or grey ones. But we suggest let go of bright blue like turquoise or aqua as they don't usually look great on you. And if we all believe that bright coloured contacts make your eyes brighter than your skin. It's real coloured contacts. They actually sent this out to their subscribers about contact lenses and whether what colour they should get for their eyes if it suits them or not. Like, it's actually disgusting that... They um they wrote stuff like that. They said for color contacts for like white skin because any color contact suits you. It's like why are you why are you like sectioning people and telling them what they can do with the eye contact but they can't. Like my cousin, she's brown. She has blue eyes, and I don't think they can be like oh because you're brown you can't have blue eyes or because you're this this color suits you. Any color suits you regardless of your color. So. I don't know, they got something to explain to do, but I am not ever ordering contact lenses from them ever again. And I am going to go back into ashes. Just so I can darken these edges a bit. 
My number one trusted eyeliner has to be the Rimmel. I go through so, 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 so many bottles of eyeliner. It's actually mad. I wear eyeliner every day. So get foundation and contour, eyeshadow. This, this is all I wear. Every day. D3. <laughs> Again, we are gonna just again again. We are just gonna go in your waterline. Like I I love this. I feel like it 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 creates your look that you want to go for. So <clears throat> now the eyes are done for now. So I'm gonna go for the face. Now I ha I got this when I was in America with my friend Arisha. This is the Boschia Perfecting White Charcoal Mattifying Treatment Primer. Let's just put it directly on the face. What I love is that it's not thick. There are so many primers out there which are crazy thick. This is not thick at all. Like it's so light. You know what guys, I got a fringe like a few months ago, like September and the fringe is taking so long to grow out it just bugs me because I want it to go I, I want the fringe to go but no I should say this before by the way guys, I'm sorry for any banging noises you hear banging noises, I am currently at my university dorm and there's work going on next door, the landlords are trying to fix stuff I was trying to fix stuff and they fix, they never ever fix the main problems. I don't know if you guys know of the little creature silverfish. I won't even like post it here. I won't even put any pictures up of it because they are so disgusting looking. Looking. And they're everywhere in my like room. Like they're always in the bathroom. Whatever bathroom I go to, they, they're just there. So they always kill it. I found two yesterday on my carpet so I wear my slippers in my room now. Like I'm Asian, yeah. I've been brought up where you don't wear shoes inside your room. So I wear it when I come to the house, I wear it. When in my room, I don't wear it. Now I have to wear it and it puts me off so much when I come into my own room. So I'm going to go with my foundation. Makeup Forever Ultra HD in Y325. This is like the best foundation. I, I This is a new thing that I've like done. Where I paint, not paint my face, but you paint your face, right? Like where you know you've got foundation. So don it around. Yeah, like you paint your face where you normally put foundation. And then the beauty blender, you just go in with it. Like ever since beauty blenders have become the new hype, I cannot use a brush to save my life. Ugh, my nose ring. So what I hate is when I'm in public, I fix my nose ring like this. And people think I'm picking my nose, but really not. I'm just twisting my nose ring around. Next, we are going to go in the Tarte Shape Tape Contour Concealer Corrector Contours. This is in light medium. I used to, to contour. No, I don't. I used to conceal. Conceal all my imperfections away. It's only about something you guys like put ever you think you need to actually conceal but you actually don't need to conceal that area. And that's me. Like I just do it but I'm like don't want it there anyway but why not? Now we're gonna go with my contour kit. Anastasia Beverly Hills contour kit. Let's try again. Yes. So as you guys can see, like, I got this like when it first came out, and I haven't hit pan yet. I was thinking about using the Fenty foundation for contour because it is so dark. Like, I got it when I came from America, and I was a bit tanned than how I am now. 
and I got the shade 310 but now it has oxidized so much it is so dark like you guys can see a big difference if I wore it you guys can tell like Dara what, what are you doing so if any of you guys want that foundation I will use like a tiny bit at least twice in your shade 310 let me know in the comments I'll give it to you I do not I do not want that foundation I do not like the Fenty foundation I liked it at the time but I think I liked it because of the hype of it like oh my god Fenty 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 40 shades people are gonna hate me for saying this but I only liked it at that time but now that I have it and I wore it a few times no now I'm gonna bake this is one of the this is my friend has this right it cost four pounds let me say it louder for people in the back four pounds <laughs> So while my face is baking, we save a few minutes, we are going to go back onto my eye and do my under eye. We are going to take the colour N Fuego again, I'm just going to go under the eye. Now we are going to go in with my eyelashes because... One thing that I love is that I got the duo glue in um, dark tone, so even if it does smudge a bit, it looks like eyeliner, so no one can tell. Life hack. Let me just do some highlighter. So I'm going to go in with the trusted Huda Beauty 3D highlighter. Oh, in go to sands. So, um... I tried doing the whole, you know, you prep it with Fiji, then you set it with sea gels, and you sculpt it with um, Tahati and Zanzibar. So let me just do that again with you guys. So, in her Snapchat, she uses her finger for Fiji, right? It was so much easier to do the mirror here, but there's not. But what can we do? The mirror here. So you apply it. Oh, I'm so scared. Okay, so I've prepped it with Fiji, and I'm going with seashells to set it. So you dab seashells, 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 seashells from the treated temple to to set and then out to pop. No, there is a pop. You guys can can you guys see that? Let me just dab the highlighter though. And then you go in with Tahati under the cheekbones to add dimension and shape. So I'm going to Tahiti. Tahati. Wow, please guys, don't be fun of my English. Tahiti. You go with Tahiti. Under the cheekbones. So. It's kind of like a contour basically, but it's not. And then lastly, sweep the Zanzibar on the apples of your cheek for a healthy glow. So let me get my Royal Technique brush again and we're going to get the Zanzibar we're going to... Sweep it. You know, I'm not mad at how it looks. Like, I don't really use that palette that much. But it's actually... Can you guys see the highlight? I think you guys can. <laughs> so we're just gonna go in there like watch how amazing. But um, yeah, we're not done yet. Wow, guys, I hate wearing lip. I hate wearing lipstick. I hate wearing lip gloss. But I wrote it just for you guys today. So this is a. Colourpop 
lip liner in Aquarius because I'm Aquarius January 23rd right in your diaries 21st birthday soon in May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December, January in nine months and we're gonna go in with the Kiko number 13 lipstick this like it is such a beautiful colour Just take up the hairpins, shake the hair around a bit. Also, let's not forget the trusted setting spray. My final look. I hope you guys enjoyed this little quick get rid of me chit chat kind of tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, leave a comment below, a like, and follow me on my handles as well. I have my Instagram, my Snapchat, and my Twitter. Mainly Instagram and Snapchat is what I use. Twitter is just Twitter. But um, yeah, you guys want to connect with me on LinkedIn, you know, you will be like professional standard and network with people. Have me on LinkedIn as well. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I see you guys in my next one.